currently 6.30 in the morning and I thought, you know what, let's get up, let's get a train to Shinjuku and um, try and get some morning photography. So off we head out. So, back in Japan. Been here a few days now and my god, am I so happy to be back. Um, I have started a couple of vlogs and they haven't really gone anywhere um, just because I've been sort of like scouting out some locations and stuff. So let's just revert back a couple of days to something that inspired this morning uh, when I went out on an early sunrise mission. And uh, I'll also introduce you to a new lens that I haven't actually shown on this channel. I had this a little while now. Uh, this is the Sigma 35 Arts lens uh, for Canon. I've had my eye on it for a couple of years now. I finally picked one up. So I managed to catch the sun just as it's coming up this morning and uh, I'm gonna head directly into it. Look how bright it is behind. And uh, of course, Japan is very, very shiny. Um, by the way, all the photos that I'm showing in this video, uh, they're all edited with my presets, which are the Urban Chrome set. Um, they're available, links in the description. They are inspired and designed purely out of my travels to Japan um, to emphasize the sort of shininess, the chrominess, and they're great for urban shots. Um, but a lot of people have also been using them for nature stuff, which is kind of cool. Um, but yeah, this is what they're intended for. So I've really enjoyed getting some shots this morning. Uh, contrary to other times when I'm out shooting, I'm generally trying to um, really hunt for those like really great shots. Um, so I guess because Japan is a place, this is now the fifth time I've been here, um, it's a place that I've explored quite a lot, uh, Tokyo as well. I'm able to sort of do that exploration to find the shot rather than documenting me exploring the place, if that makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> uh, by the way, something I haven't mentioned. Um, so the other day I went to Dispatch, uh, finally. Um, so I mentioned in uh, a video about six months ago that I really wanted to get one of these straps and I was like yep I'm gonna check them out online when I get back home delivery was like a hundred US dollars so I was like no I'm waiting till I'm back in Japan oh it's noisy so yeah finally picked up a uh, strap for my Canon I got another one for my Fujifilm as well um, I'll show that one later when I'm shooting with that camera <laughs> So what am I doing back in Japan again? Um, so I've actually got a few different things that I'm working on. Uh, one in particular is uh, kind of like a, a new sort of business idea, a bit of a, um, a thing that I'd sort of briefly mentioned in a live stream um, like a year and a bit ago. And uh, I'm just sort of scouting out and just working out the logistics of things. Um, so that's something that is maybe gonna launch later this year, providing it all goes well. Um, the reason I'm specifically not mentioning it now is just in case it doesn't happen and it never goes ahead. Um, and then I've got a few other things that I'm working on. So there's a few videos that um, I've had ideas for. Uh, stuff that's more on the sort of filmmaking side, more to you know teach myself on uh, better video production side of things rather than vlogging. So yeah, I'm working on a few things. I'm only here for a couple of weeks this time, um, but any time in Japan is an amazing time. Right, it's breakfast now. Um, is it acceptable to get Mr. Donut for breakfast? I mean, it, it's 8.30, been out for a couple hours.
so just been wandering around Shinjuku for a, a good couple of hours now. Um, I went and got some breakfast as well. And in the meantime, throughout all that time, I've managed to lose the eye cup on my GH5. So uh, yeah, kind of annoying. I think it just slipped off as it was on my side. So I'm gonna have to go and find one of those now. Uh, anyway, so the sun's coming up pretty high. Lighting's getting pretty harsh. Uh, so I think I'm gonna head back edit a little bit for the afternoon then come out again this evening. Essentially for this video I just wanted to announce that back in Japan there's a few videos coming. Not necessarily all going to be vlogs um, but I hope you uh, stick around to watch those because I'm really excited to make them. So uh, yeah make sure you do subscribe to this channel and I'll catch you later. See ya, bye bye. The doors on the right side will open.